All right, campaigns made simple. Here we go. So the first thing you're going to do is click on campaigns at the top left. You're going to click the plus sign at the top right, and you're going to name this campaign. So I named it test example drip, and I'm going to click create campaign. So it pops up, and the first thing I'm going to do is click add a card, and then I'm going to go find my card. The first card I'm going to do is an Easter card. So I'm going to type in Easter. I can spell it. Find my Easter card. So you click on the card that you choose. When you see colors down here, you can choose the color scheme. And you open the card. Open your card and begin to edit the inside. So I put a verse on the left. On the right side, I'm going to choose my font. And I'm going to make it just a little bit bigger. I can choose my color of my font if I want to, but I'm leaving this font black. Because this is a campaign and I don't want to have to put the name in every time, I'm going to click first name on the bottom left down here. And then it's going to fill in the person's first name, whoever I decide to send this card to. And then I say my sentiment and then insert my signature. These are the signature fonts that they have uploaded for me and I actually signed it and they created it. This is my custom card back that I created and it's on the back of every card. I can change this if I want to. So I'm gonna make it this one. These are going to my customers so they don't need to know how to become a Send Out Cards customer and I'm gonna click Add to Campaign on the bottom right. Now this particular card is gonna go out um, immediately because Easter is April the 17th, but if I wanted to change the date that it gets mailed, I could do that. Now my next card, is going to be a 4th of July card and I simply typed in July 4th and I'm going to make this card a flat card. All right, so there we are. Got that going, add to campaign. Okay. All right, so we're going to change the date that this gets mailed out. So I'm going to click edit. I'm going to click send delay and then I'm going to click send on a specific date. We're going to mail it on June the 20th, which would be just as just about two weeks beforehand. There you go. So there's that one. All right, so for the last card, October 7th is World Smile Day. So there you go. It's a wonderful day to smile. And we will talk about World Smile Day in this card. All right. So put all this in here. Random Smile Day. Random Smile Day. And then on the back, it's cool to be kind. And then click Add to Campaign at the bottom right. So then I'm going to change the date that this gets sent out, send delay, send on a specific date. I'm going to send it on September the probably 25th would be plenty of time to get it out there. And there you go. So I can send this to one person. I can send it to 10 people. I can send it to 500 people if I want to. When you're ready to send this campaign, somebody new comes into your life, you can just simply click send order. Select all, create, then you click add recipients. I have uh, a group of people already set up. So all I did was click that group and then they all appear here and I click ready to send. So you can see how this is using 15 system sends today. It's the um, stamps are right here, estimated total. And then I don't pay for my cards because I've got a bulk plan and I click send. Done and done. So now those people are getting these three cards at the time that I specified. And my job is finished and they will get dripped on three times for the rest of the year.